Hi, it's Darren. Welcome to Tuesday. I think everybody realizes that we've been doing pre-slack because it's been open discussion. Hopefully, we'll get back into that. Probably not this week. Probably not till next week or the week after. Due to the fact that, like, exams and stuff, I hope that you guys do well. I would hate for it to just crumble. I'm willing to do it, if you're willing to do it. The theme that I missed, the theme that I suggested, fail, I know, was uh, bucket lists. Things to do that we want to do before we die. First thing on my bucket list is to get published. And this means either like a no novel published or like an article maybe that I've written for a magazine published or even like a song that I've written performed in front of an audience, or a play or a movie that I've written performed in front of an audience, though I suppose a movie isn't performed in front of an audience, but it could be shown to an audience, like projected, like projected. The second thing on my bucket list is to travel to another continent. Like, I really want to go to Japan, and I want to go to, uh, to, uh, like Italy, because it's like beautiful and like stone kind of things that I've seen on videos and pictures and things uh... looks great looks great number three is less likely than the first two and it is meet and converse with a hero or meet or converse with a hero two that come to mind are Rob Doby and Tina Fey because they are like, they sort of blow my mind with the things that they do. If you don't know who Rob Doby is, he's an artist. He's the designer who does the uh, Foley t-shirts that I love so much and I'm not wearing right now. But hopefully that'll happen with the power that is the bucket list. The next one, number four, which ties into number three, I guess, is to... Uh, work with Ellen Page and Drew Barrymore. It is even less likely than the third one to happen, but I want it to happen so much. You know who Ellen Page is. She's talented. She's an actress. She's from Halifax, right? She's adorable. She's completely adorable. I mean, I don't think I have a chance with her, but, um, I mean, I, I could try, fail miserably, try maybe come off as a creep maybe not come off as a creep we'll see maybe if it happens and Drew Barrymore she just she just goes into things and makes everything that she's in to awesome with it Charlie's Angels music and lyrics E.T. I mean <laughs> fifth thing on my bucket list is to sell something that I've made ties into number one which you know I mean I could sell a script or I could sell a novel um, but it would also be cool to be able to like to design something that is like visual art and sell it like just like artist posters or t-shirt designs number six on my bucket list is Yes, cheesy Jasmine, but I would like to have children as well of my own from my genetics. I think that you will find in every single Sims game where I've made myself, I've made myself into a family sim. I mean, it's like get married, have kids, have grandkids, maybe great-grandkids, but if it were the Sims, I would probably die before I had great-grandkids. I'm hoping that doesn't happen IRL, but we'll see, I guess. The seventh thing on bucket list is to bury a time capsule, like material objects that mean a lot to me, and then like maybe write 
about them and put them in a box or something sealed and just bury it somewhere and then somehow leaves like a trail, something in my will or something for somebody to find and maybe not even necessarily about me, but maybe something that I'm involved with. A school or maybe the super grads could do a time capsule at the end of our run. We could put like a DVD together of messages and stuff. Uh, that would be really cool. That would be really cool. That would be really cool. It's working. It's working. We'll talk about it. The eighth thing on my bucket list nah. is to uh, learn and perform an instrument. I mean, to learn an instrument is one thing, but then to have enough confidence in your newfound skill in the instrument to want to to perform it in front of people would be pretty intense for me. I know in school I played like percussion and stuff, but I'm thinking guitar, bass guitar, <laughs> uh, piano, something along those lines, not anything where I have to blow. <laughs> Trumpet, I was not good at. It's, I'll leave that, I'll leave that to Kevin. I'll leave that to Kevin. The second last thing on my bucket list of things to do before I die, which I guess is the ninth, I uh, want to go to a major award ceremony, uh, such as like the Oscars or the Grammys or maybe even the Tonys, though I'm not too into the whole theater thing. Maybe in the future I will be and still have more invested into the Tonys, but right now it's sort of a it would be nice type of thing, but it's not as important to me as the Oscars or the Grammys. And the final thing, the tenth thing to do before I die is to skydive or base jump. So I think we all should experience falling with what seems like a bottomless dive. We could do that together too. We could just super grads go skydiving. We can do all of these things together. Let's organize it. Just kidding. But we could. Maybe. I guess that's it for uh, for uh, me this week. I'll be seeing you next week. Um. It'll probably be a, a pre-recorded thing, but that's just so that I know that it's done. The power that is the bucket list.